Hey guys, so today I wanted to show you how I do my shot. So the first thing that I do is I get all my stuff from over here. I get one needle. Needle. Um, are they in here? Yes. Yeah. I get one syringe. And then I get my testosterone. I get my band-aid, my rubbing alcohol, and I have one little cleaning pad thing left. And then I go over to the couch. The first thing that we want to do is um, get... My hands are clean, so you gotta make sure you do that first. And I'm gonna be doing it right here. Every time you do it, you kind of want to you want to move around your spot so it's not always in the same spot. So what we're going to do first is take this here, open this up, and we're going to take the alcohol, the rubbing alcohol, and just kind of put a little bit on there. And the reason I do this first is because you have to wait for it to dry. So you just put that on your leg. I kind of just do it like all over and make sure it's all clean because I don't know exactly where I'm going to do it yet. Oops. And then that's done. The next thing you want to do is I'm going to open this first. This is different. This is a new flip off. I haven't used this little bottle yet, so. There we go. Okay, so what this has is it's basically a little container full of testosterone. You can't undo it or anything. What you do is you just put the needle in. So it's kind of, yeah, it's like that. And the next thing we're going to do is take this. Um, go like that. So you're not touching anything with your hands. And open up this. Take this out and then screw this in. Some of them you don't screw in, other ones you just push in. It really depends. So there we go. Um, I'll put all the information for this stuff in the description because to inject testosterone you have to use um, specific needles and a specific syringe depending on your dosage. So the next thing we're going to do is put this in here. So. Pull this off without touching it. Do this kind of sideways. Put it in. Just like that. Make sure that you are not in the air, but you're actually in the stuff. So, like that, and then pull it back. My dosage is 100... Um, 100 milligrams or 0 0.5 milliliters. So what I like to do is just go as far back as I can, kind of tap it a little bit, make it all go in. I go way above what I'm um, supposed to have, so then I just push the extra stuff back in. And just push it to your dosage. There we go. Pull it out, and now you're ready to go. So what you're going to do is you're just going to pick a spot on your leg where you cleaned it, and basically make sure your leg is nice and relaxed, make sure you're relaxed, take a deep breath, get your needle ready, relax, relax, relax. Count to three, just go one, two, three, just like that. And then you're going to pull back, and make sure that there's no blood in the syringe, and then you're just going to push it in. There you go, and then pull it out. One, two, three. Just like that, and you're done. So that is basically how I do it. 
you can do this a bunch of different ways, but that is the way that my doctor taught me. And it's been working for me. So, yeah, if you guys have any questions or anything, you can leave a comment. And hopefully, um, I can help you out with whatever it is. But yeah, um, I'll see you guys next Thursday. Thank you for watching. Bye. Just like that, and all you're going to do is count down from three, and then jab it in. Okay. Ready? And one, two, three.